provides a variety of search options from simple name or word searches to more complex variable searches. In this video, we're going to explore some of the basic lookups to locate contacts. We'll perform a universal search to expand our search range to include notes and history, and we'll also examine how a contact activity lookup helps us to find contacts based on recent or past revisions. So a lookup is really just a list of records that results from performing a search of the database. We can start this search in a number of different ways. One way is by using the lookup menu at the top of the screen. This shows us many of the different fields and categories through which we can search. We also have the lookup pane on the left just above our navigation buttons. We're going to use this one first. Let's say that I'm planning a trip to Florida to visit one of my contacts there. But before I go, I'd like to see if there are any other contacts nearby who I could meet while I'm on my trip. Now the best way to start is to do a lookup on the state of Florida. So the contact field that I want to search for is going to be state. And then in the contains field, I'm just going to type FL for Florida and click go. ACT displays the contacts that I have in Florida. Now I can see I have a bunch in Sarasota and some in Tampa and some other places. They're not all that close to one another, but it may be worthwhile for me to contact them just in case a meeting may be beneficial for business. Another search tool that we have is called the Universal Search. This looks through all of the information in our database, rather than just a contact record. The Universal Search includes notes, activities, opportunities, and even attachments. We can then filter the results to narrow our search if needed. So let's say that I'm sending a contract agreement to a new client, and I'd like to save some time by finding some of the cover letters that I've used in the past with other clients. To locate these, I'm going to go to the Universal Search box in the upper right corner, and I'm going to type DOC for document and PDF. Now between those two items, I'm going to add the operator OR to indicate that I will accept either of these two results. Now I'll click Go, and the Universal Search retrieves a lot of results. I can filter these results though by just checking the Attachments box on the right. This fine tunes our list to show us only file attachments. Now if I scroll down, I can locate a cover letter that I have to reuse with my new client if I choose. A third type of lookup is the contact activity lookup. This type of search allows us to find contacts whose records either have or have not been modified within a period of time that we determine. Let's find out who I haven't contacted since November 1st. From my lookup menu, I'm going to click Contact Activity. On this screen, I'm looking for contacts that have not changed, and the date I want to use is going to be November 30th. Down below, I'm not really interested in contact fields, notes, or opportunities, but I do want to know if I've had any history or activities scheduled with them since November 30th. So I'm going to click OK, and now I can see I have a list of 12 contacts. Obviously, I have some work to do. So ACT provides very powerful search options from the basic lookup to a universal search. It even helps us to find contacts based upon my level of activity with them over a given period of time.